What's up, YouTube? I'm your host, Dead Walker, and welcome to another Advanced Warfare Weapon Discussion. In today's discussion, I will be focused on the BAL-27 Tactical Variant. On my last discussion video, I went over the BAL-27 Base Variant, so you should definitely check that out since I'll be discussing the Tactical Variant, assuming you know the information that I mentioned on that video. The Tactical Variant isn't much different than the Base Variant, but it does provide the player with a bit more range, and as a drawback, it increases the hit fire spread. Because of the accuracy this weapon provides, most people, including myself, will be firing while aiming down the sights. So the fact that the hip fire spread has increased will not negatively affect us in any way. On top of that, even if you do find yourself hip firing, the increase is so small you might not even notice the difference. The Bell 27 Tactical is an enlisted variant that is practically beneficial and nothing less. As for what I think the best attachments for this weapon are, I'd recommend the foregrip and extended max. You could also attach laser sight if you wanted to counter the small increase in hip fire spread, but, be but since the change is very small, you'd be better off using that point on something else. Personally, I think this is an awesome weapon and I don't see, if, if you guys have access to the BAL-27 tactical variant, there shouldn't be any reason why you're, you're choosing to use the base variant over the tactical. I mean, there, there are for, there's definitely better variants than the tactical, um, BAL-27 tactical variant. But if you don't have access to those, but you do have access to the tactical, it's it's a really good idea to be using this over the Bell 27 cents. All it does is give you better range for little to no different and and, and, and hip fire spread. So it's it's just uh, an improvement on the base variant and nothing less. And those are my opinions. And I actually tend to use um, the Bell the Bell 27 tactical over other variants just because. It has the extremely great accuracy of the base variant compared to other, like even the elites. Yeah, they have fire, um, faster hip, um, fire rate and and I guess a little bit of increased damage. But the but when you're in long range firefights, it kind of messes you up a little because um, you can't really stay on target that often. So this when when you're feeling like being at, as accurate as possible. Instead of using the Bell 27 base variant, you should go out after the tactical variant. Since it has increased range, so it, it, it helps even it helps even more. So I hope you guys enjoyed this web, advanced warfare weapon discussion. If you did, be sure to subscribe and come back for more discussions in the future. If you have any questions, be sure to ask them down below, and I'd be also be interested in on your thoughts on the Bell 27 tactical. So what do you guys think? Do you guys have any preferred attachments? If you do use the tactical, if you don't use the tactical, why not? Um, I'm very curious, so be sure to leave that all that information down in the comment section if you guys are interested in communicating with me. I'm Dead Walker, and until next time, guys, I'll be seeing you awesome people online.